Hi guys, welcome. We're going to play Labyrinth. So this is your how to play your demo game. We have no idea what's going to happen, <laughs> but somebody has a slight idea what's going to happen. It's the game's creator, Alessio Cavatori of River Horse. Alessio. Hello. It's Labyrinth. <laughs> Smell bird. Right, oh, okay, no. I'll have to get that out of the way, <laughs> but I'll probably say it a few more times. So, Alessio, uh, um, take us through it. Let's get stuck in. <laughs> yes, so Jim Henson's The Labyrinth, and we got to make the game, and I'm, I mean, I'm chuffed. It's one of my favorite movies, so it was amazing to work on this. <laughs> so, how the game works? Uh, the game is divided into uh, a first phase where the characters are going around the labyrinth, and they are trying to find the entrance to Goblin City. Mm -hmm. Once they find the entrance, or if they find the entrance, uh, they will. Uh, uh, Jareth will panic, get into his castle, call up the guards, and kind of fortify it all. And uh, then the characters will have to make their way through the gate, through Humongous, the garden, the warden of the gate, and then through the all the all the armies of Jareth, all the guards, all the goblin guards, and get to the castle. Mm -hmm. When they get to the castle, then Sarah mm, gets to face off against Jareth, and if she can defeat him, then she will recite the spell and save her brother from turning into a goblin babe. Okay, mm -hmm. awesome. So there's four there's four main characters. There's, a, there's, a, there's a, a number of different modes that the game can be kind of played in, isn't there? Yes, ideally it's designed as a four player game. Mm -hmm. It's a cooperative game, so the, the four of us would be each one a character. So Sarah, Ludo, Sir Didymus and Hoggle mm -hmm. as a team. We are working together to basically bunch up first. I mean, being together, moving together is key to this. So it's like finding your friends in the labyrinth, becoming friends, moving together as a group. And then is, that's a four player game, mm -hmm. ideally, where we each have a player. Then you can play as a three player. Yep. Like we're doing now, so we're one player. Like you controls a couple of characters. I get two guys, yeah. yeah. And if two players, obviously, you would have to two each. Mm -hmm. One player can play on his own, so you can play by controlling all the, all the characters mm -hmm. against the, the game itself. Uh, you can also have a five player version where, as, as well as the four cooperating players, there is the, the player that, that plays Jareth. And what he does, he makes the game more difficult because he chooses. Cards makes it a bit more, a bit tougher for the for the other player. So the five-player yeah. version is is actually more difficult. Awesome, awesome. Right. Well, we're going to we're going to play through a game of this, Alessio. So kick us off. What what do we have? Right. So we have characters. We can start in positions here. This starts in where in the movie Sarah has just fallen into the oubliette, mm -hmm. and Jareth has sent Hoggle to take her back to the entrance. Mm -hmm. uh, Ludo is hanging upside down in a, yep. in a trap there, and Didymus is here guarding the guarding the, the bridge. Mm -hmm. Now I shall pass without my permission. <laughs> and uh, so we begin uh, the marker, the Toby marker, the babe yeah. marker. So this. Mm -hmm. Just On remember Hoggle. who times who starts. Hogo has the first move. Okay. Sarah has Sarah has the last move, and then the clock ticks. So we start on turn one. Mm -hmm. We have thirteen hours. Yeah, <laughs> there's a thirteen hours clock. It's yeah. a goblin clock. Thirteen hours to to get to to the end. Otherwise, you lose basically, which makes mm -hmm. the game. Fast and challenging, yeah. of course, and you kind of know how much is gonna how much is gonna last, which okay. is also practical. All yeah. right. Well, uh, first things first. If I'm taking the first turn, what are my options here? Right. So if you look at your card, uh -huh. uh, you have the Hoggle card. Yeah. Uh, Hoggle has uh, three stats. Well, all the characters have three stats, which mm -hmm. are speed, yeah, wit, and brawn. Mm -hmm. So basically, how fast you are, how clever you are, or knowledgeable of the labyrinth, mm -hmm. and how strong you are. Yeah, and then I have these three tokens here. What are these? This is your willpower. So effectively, uh -huh. those are your wounds, so to speak. So basically, uh, if you become really, really depressed, tired, uh, lose heart, okay. then eventually you will fall into the bliet. The ground will open, and your character falls into the bliet when it gets to zero willpower. Okay. When you get zero willpower, get into the bliet where you can rest and gain back some willpower. Okay. So on my turn, what options do I have for action? When is your turn? Uh, you roll your dice for speed. In this uh -huh. case, it's a d6. You can always roll uh, the dice, which is that's your maximum speed, or you can uh -huh. roll less if you want. Okay. A fewer, a smaller dice. So in your case, you could roll that. Okay, so I can roll either the d6 or the d4. Yeah, or as we say, okay. the green dice or the, or the red dice. Because okay. basically, the dice are color-coded, so you don't refer to d4s, d6s. But for simplicity, it's always the red dice, the blue dice. Okay. This is designed so that actually I can play with my six-year-old daughter. Okay. <laughs> That's the main point of this. I showed her the movie, she loves it, I want to share that with her, and therefore it's all designed that mm -hmm. way. So the blue dice, the green dice, the red dice. Yeah. Okay, uh, right. Is there anything else we need to do before we begin the game? 
Yes, we do. We need to prepare the actual deck of Labyrinth cards. Okay. So this will determine the encounters we have through the first phase when we adventure through the Labyrinth. Mm. So what I do is I remove one card at random and I burn it for this game so that every time they get the deck is a little different. Uh -huh. uh, then I find the entrance to Goblin City card, which is the one we are trying to find. So we have to find the entrance that leads here to the yep. entrance. Uh, then I'll take the first one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten cards. Mm -hmm. Those ten cards, I'll shuffle the entrance to Goblin City in the ten cards. Mm -hmm. Give it a shuffle. So I know that the entrance will be in one of the last 10, 11 cards, because mm -hmm. these go at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so we really need to burn through that deck to actually get to it, yes. yeah? Yes, so we have to basically work our way through the deck, mm -hmm. you know, through all the first 20 cards, and mm -hmm. then there's another about 10 cards there, and there we will find the entrance. So like okay. in the in the poem or in the spell, or the other thing, we have to fight our way through the labyrinth to get mm -hmm. to Goblin City. Okay, well, uh, I'll take my first turn. And I've rolled by accident. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it because it's a four. Okay. Uh, so now I have the option of going left or right. Yeah. Yes, you go left or right, and obviously the choice is influenced by what cards are already in play, where the other characters are, because you want to go and bunch up. Remember, okay. it's a cooperative mm -hmm. game, so right. uh, and bunching up is good. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go one, two, three, four directly towards Stephanie, because that's what Hoggle would do in the movie. Stephanie. <laughs> Stephanie. Sarah. Sarah. Sorry, Warren has been doing this to me for weeks now because he keeps going, smells bad, Stephanie. And there's a story behind that, but we'll get to that at another time. I was like, who's Stephanie? <laughs> I will head right towards Sarah. Yeah. Oh, embarrassing. Okay, right. So I went directly for towards Sarah. Yes. Yep. And we'll take what happens now? the card from the, <laughs> okay. the deck. Sorry. You met a sleepy goblin guard. Okay. Uh, so you remember this is the one who normally sleeps in front of the of the gate in the movie. Okay. Anyway, so you can actually test your speed. Uh huh. And basically try to sneak past it without waking it up. Okay. Or fight it. Yeah, uh, you know, that uh, would be the Didymus thing to do is to fight it. But uh, I'm gonna try and sneak past on my my green dice. Okay. So, so you roll a dice for your speed. Yep. Uh, two. Uh -oh. Uh -oh, two. I will be the sentinel, but any any of us could be the guard. A two. two. So it's the same number, which means that. In case of a draw, the characters win. Nice. So, so I snuck past them. You snuck mm -hmm. past it. So you look at the card, and the card says, success, discard, discard. So the card is discarded and goes at the bottom of the pile. So okay. again, you don't get a sense, an exact sense of how many cards you've gone through already. Right. So you don't go, oh, it should be real about now. After, right. the, after you go through 20 years ago, how many? Is there anything to keep track? Okay, so right. that's me done. That's me done. So I get the babe. I am Sir Didymus, which is yep. my favorite character in the movie. And I can go at my top speed because I really want to get closer to where there's a lot of characters. So your top speed is black. My, my top speed is black, yeah, which up to 12 well. spaces. Mm -hmm. And of course, they're all the two. <laughs> Not very impressive. I'll go there. And I'll draw <gasps> one very scary card. <laughs> this is a card of the type called Jarrett Appears, because mm -hmm. he does that a lot. He suddenly, in the labyrinth, he suddenly... I suddenly meet him. Uh, Jared appears and he says, ooh, maybe it's time to up the stakes. So I have to have a test, a wit test, because Jared is all about wit, against the blue dice, the strongest dice. So you can be Jared. And the wit of Didymus is a D8, or a yellow dice. Mm -hmm. A three. A three. He's <laughs> a little bit sleepy today. I can do it. I can do it. Four. <laughs> so I managed <laughs> just about. I mean, in a non-characteristic way, uh, Didymus manages to work with Jareth. Yeah. Otherwise, otherwise Jareth would have upped the stakes by turning the clock forward, Whoa. which is really, away the time. Right, really okay. bad. So mm -hmm. good, good that you're all bad. <laughs> okay. Quick question: Does Jareth now stay there on the board? Yes. The, the card has two effects. One is the challenge. The second one is now Jareth is in this space, uh -huh. which means that. Uh, a character can, characters cannot land in that space. So okay. say I was here and I rolled a, a three, Aye. I would go one, two, three, or one, two, three. Normally I have two choices. Aye. In this case, I have only one choice. Okay. So I can never go there. Can which... you move past it though? Can you move Oh over yeah, yeah, it? if you're all, oh, if you're okay. all okay. a six or a seven, it. okay. yeah, it's That's... all about landing. Mm -hmm. So if I, <laughs> that means that it turns my two double choice into a single choice, which sometimes forces me to land into spaces where I Normally, really didn't so want to go. You might land in the bog. In the bog of the stench, or in you know bad yeah. places that appeared on the board. Okay. Okay. Hand me the babe, and the babe goes to Ludo. Okay, so Ludo's turn. Ooh. 
Right, so Ludo's speed is yellow dice. Okay. So let's go for this. Six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. That could be useful. That yep. could be useful. So I'm gonna go to there, which is right next to where Sarah is. Yep. So and my ooh. card. Dum dum dum. Dum dum dum. Jareth appears. Whoop. So he moves over to there. All right. Place Jareth on this space. Keep this card on your character sheet. When in the same space as Sarah, or if you are Sarah, immediately test wit versus one blue die. You cannot test as a group. Yep. Okay. So, so basically, that means the title is the peach. The peach. So that's why Jared gives you the peach, and he go and he tells you give this to Sarah when you meet her. So now so. you are on a mission for Jared to give the peach to Sarah. <laughs> uh, oh, I don't know how much Hoggle had got that card. Right. Yeah. And when the, when the time comes, you will have to test against wit, which means that you have to try to resist. Yeah, and my wit command. at the lowest, the guy with the lowest wit ended up getting that. You, you probably yeah. didn't get there was a problem. <laughs> oh, nice, nice speech from <laughs> Sarah, <laughs> yes. Okay, so the okay. babe then transfers to Sarah now. Uh -huh. yeah. Um And I wanted Sarah to originally go with uh, Ludo, but... You could I'm, come and join Hoggle. I'm going to try and join Hoggle. So Sarah could move up to a purple die for speed, Which but as you detail. said, I can move less. You can slow so down, I, yeah. So if I go with a red die, I could move up to a maximum of four, yeah. so I'm more likely to be able to catch up That's with right. one of these guys. Basically, st full speed is you running at top mm -hmm. speed, but actually maybe you heard some noise and you're slowing down to see what's going on. So okay. you roll a, a small so dice. roll a red die. Three. I got a three. three. Close. Which is one, two, all oh, very close, but just past. Three. Yeah. Okay, so what Ooh. did I get? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Hearing that noise from the game's creator is not a, a good it's thing. A, it's a dangerous place. It's a dangerous place to land up. You landed in the middle of the of the fireys camp. Oh. So they want to play with you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey lady, it's against the rules to throw other people's head. <laughs> right. Uh, so you can choose uh, to run away. So if I could take a speed test against mm -hmm. the purple dice, so the same and, speed as you. Yep. Or you can brown your way, fighting them with a, against the purple die and the black die, and your brown is only a decision. Run, run. So running sounds uh, like yeah. the, the right idea. Okay, so, um, so let me roll first. So. Okay, so you roll. Is oh, it you want to be the speed? We're going to do speed. It's just yeah. a purple die. Oh, just it? Oh, yep. So, sorry. Okay, yeah, it's just yeah. a purple die. Yep. So. An, An eight. eight. Oh, he's very good at rolling bad. Uh, whenever us. it's against the rest of the guys, I roll insanely. Okay, so, and I'm going to roll... A one. A one. A one. So Sarah can, cannot outrun the, the fires. Now, okay. in the case of a fail, you will lose two willpower. Ah. Which is quite harsh. Basically, uh, characters have a number of willpower. Sarah is the one with the most. She starts yeah. with five. Mm -hmm. uh, and Hogul is the worst. He starts with three because he's a yeah. bit of a coward. While yeah. the, the two of us are average at four. Mm -hmm. So okay. you can lose two, basically fail. Okay. Or you can decide to re-roll your dice. In fact, rolling a blue dice instead of your normal dice mm -hmm. by spending one of those instead of... So are you taking the gamble? Yeah. Because if you fail, then you'll still lose two. But yeah, oh. you're against an eight, so it's, it's an eight. better than fifty percent mm -hmm. chance. Yeah, an eight okay. is not bad. Right. Well, let's let's do that. I'm going to spend one. Mm -hmm. to so basically, Sarah pushes herself to run faster, run faster, and rolls a one. Trips and falls <laughs> on her face. So I have now managed to lose three in total instead of two. Yes. So. Yes. Good. Good turn. Oh. And and the camp stays there. In theory, you can keep rolling the d20, spending more willpower, but that. Possibly could be yeah yeah. Risky. I'm, I'm you, going you to two already. Yeah. Out, like, <laughs> a bad start. Okay. okay. Uh, so that Sarah has went. That Sarah. So the clock moves and now forward. Is the clock? Go on. Clock, 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 clock. Goes to two. Yeah. Two. So I pass the babe over uh, to Hogwart. Hogwart. <laughs> right. Uh, <laughs> I am actually going to take the red die. Uh huh. Because I think I may try and land on Sarah. Yeah, but you land on the fi on the fire is well. Ah, but I think we can fight together on that. Together, you can do yeah as a group. You have a better chance. Yeah. Well, so, uh, go for it. And then we can move around the board together. Ah, a four. Four. Which is a shame. One, two, three, four. I think I'll go this way. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what happens now? False alarms. Uh oh. Oh, turn back. This is the wrong way. So yeah, but it's a rather easy. Test here because the false alarms are not really very believable. So uh, you roll a wit test against the d4 against the red okay. dice. Well, I have a, a black dice for the wit. Mm -hmm. 
the, let's see what we get here. Yes. It. Easy. It versus Easy. one. That's you've seen one. you've seen whole good games this time. He just goes, "Oh, come on, shut up! <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, let me say it at least once." <laughs> okay, so the babe then moves back to Sir Didymus. Sir Didymus, mm -hmm. which for some reason picks up a card. No, Sir Didymus <laughs> goes on a nine. Okay, mm -hmm. can I join somebody? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Join me. I will join. Hoggle on the false alarms, so together we can fight against the false alarms. Mm -hmm. My wit. Yeah. Yes. So One. No problem. Mm -hmm. We are free. And now we are together. You know, yes. I could have gone the other way and possibly revealed the card, which probably would have been a good thing because we need to burn through this. But I think joining together makes it an easier to, to, yeah, to win the challenges. Now, as we're revealing cards, we'll be able to deal with them together. Okay, so because the babe we always combine our our staff using the best. Passes to Ludo again. Okay. Mm, yes. So if I can get the babe, the babe. okay. Um, Ludo's going to travel at his full speed. Are you sure you don't want to go on a red die? Yeah. You might be able to join myself and Sir Didymus. Yeah, it's very, well, his wit is low. He doesn't understand. Yeah, let, let, let's try. <laughs> what? <laughs> a one. A one. Yay! <laughs> so I get to join. The, Whoa. These guys, but I have to do this uh, alarm test again. Yes, but we all do it. Yes, we do as a group. So okay. the alarm is a three. Okay. And we need to beat a three. Come on, guys. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. A one. I don't a believe one. This. Two one so far. <laughs> Come on, Didymus. It's all down to you. Three. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so by the power of being a group, so you would have lost. Yes. You also would have lost. Yeah. But by being together, we get to choose the highest result, which is a three, which is just enough to, to tell the alarms to shut up. Teamwork. <laughs> Teamwork. Yeah. Teamwork. Yes. But Ooh. I think this works out perfectly at the minute. Because of Ludo having that damned peach, yes. Stephanie's off on her own, which mm -hmm. is fine. Mm -hmm. Sarah. Right. Sarah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Warren has been calling her Stephanie for weeks, so I apologize. <laughs> it's just stuck in my head. Right. Don't know me, man. Serious? Right. Right. I'm serious. Come on. Right. Okay. okay. <laughs> right. So, time for Stephanie, not Justin. Aye, aye, aye. <laughs> right. It's you okay. that has caused me to do this, so it's your damn fault. Right. Okay. <laughs> So, Sarah. I'm blushing. Oh, stop it. Oh, okay. Stop it. Stop it. Sarah is going to go <laughs> full speed. Yeah. <laughs> so, let's see. Come on, Sarah. <laughs> Two. Uh, no. Well, come on, we get to see a card. Away from us. Okay, so we get to see a card. So, she's going to go one. Two okay. towards the main grip. Yeah, uh -huh. And that is a goblin, some goblin guards. Uh, you have to fight them. So, it's brown against the green and yellow dice. So, mm -hmm. the. Goblins. There's a bunch of them. Roll a four. So the best I can get is a four. So um, I need a five or a six on my no, brawn. Four, five, four, five, or six. Four, five, or six. You need, just okay. need to match them. So let's see. A two. two. Right. Of course it was a two. <laughs> <laughs> so if you, fail, if you fail, you will lose one willpower. Or I'm you gonna, can spend I'm one gonna, willpower I'm to spend the willpower. I'm just gonna gamble against the gamble four. Gamble my yeah. d20 against the four. Yeah, against okay. the four. Come on, now. Yes. Yes. Six. Easy. That's six. Right. So you spend the willpower instead, and uh, discard the cast, so the goblins are defeated and put mm -hmm. back under the deck. Okay. There. Okay. That the babe now passes, but, yeah. and the clock clicks on. Yeah, and Sarah is down to her last willpower already, which is scary. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. So uh, I'm just going to move my full speed of six, because I don't think there's anyone slower yeah. than me. When you move as a group, you had to slow down to the, to the slowest guy in the group. Obviously, you, you couldn't keep up with, uh, with Mighty Ambrosius. Yeah. Quick question. Do we have the option to separate? Well, you, you don't have to go with the person that is moving, but of mm. course, 99%, I would say 100% of the time, it's always better to stick together. Okay. There's only one case where People may not want to stick together. Is somebody has fallen into the bog of the eternal stench? Okay, uh, has a smell bad. Sorry, you say smell bad. <laughs> <Exactly>. Stephanie. <laughs> <laughs> somebody uh -huh. with death counter uh, will may be left behind because of the smell of the stench. Okay. But okay. other than that, normally is a good idea to move together. Okay, mm -hmm. so let's see what I get here. A four. Four. Where do we go? One, two, three, four. Next to Sarah, or one, two, three, four. Away from Sarah. Uh, I think we'll move next to Sarah. Yeah, I don't think we should let the evil peach of Jareth deter us from getting together with okay. Sarah. Come on. Yeah, there we go. So, we got a card? Mm -hmm. We get a card. Oh, Jareth appears. Oh, <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Turn back. Turn back, Sarah. Right. We have no choice but to take a wit test. Okay. Individually. 
Oh. Yeah, you cannot test as a group. So this is an exception to the rules. Normally, you can always test as a group unless a cow specifically says that. Okay. So this is Jareth telling you, specifically you, to go back to the to the star. Okay, so I will roll my wit of a black die. Yep. Mm -hmm. And gain a seven. Mm -hmm. Jareth is always a blue die. He's quite witty. I was one! <laughs> so he goes, turn back, and you go, no! no. <laughs> <laughs> so does each person on the tile have to test? Separately, then, or just uh, no? In th this case, it, it just challenges one player. Yeah, okay. there are exceptions, <clears throat> but normally the rule is if you're a group, you just everybody rolls unless okay. the card specifically says mm. single okay. test on a single guy. That's fine. Yep. So uh, right, babe goes to Sir Didymus. Sir Didymus. <laughs> and I will slow down to your speed so we can all all go together. Yep. <clears throat> four. I rolled a four. So one, two, three. Four. Ooh, one, two, three, four. Which brings us back to the to the false alarms. Not interesting. One, two, three, four. Let's go this way, guys. One, two, three, four. Hmm. What do we get? You know, ah. jar the pier cards. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> we shuffle these so well. <laughs> right. And this is where Jared goes, oh, so the labyrinth is a piece of cake. Right, so first of all, we have a wit test as a group against Jareth. Mm -hmm. So, okay. who wants to be Jareth? Uh, I'll roll for Jareth. A a 16, which means that basically there's no point in rolling. <laughs> yeah, we would lose that. that. We could try to spend willpower to beat it, but let's not because this is all it does if you lose in the case of a fail. He will roll, uh, lob, his, uh, lob his orb into the, to into the tunnel and summon the cleaners. So we suddenly have the cleaners coming towards us. Right. So ah. this is the second <clears throat> test. Oh no, the cleaners in case of a fail, which we mm -hmm. did. Uh -huh. uh, so we have now to test the speed test against the yellow dice. I'll let right. someone else roll this. Right, who wants to be the cleaners? You're okay, the cleaners? I'll be the cleaners. Are you ready? Yeah. You ready? Three. Three. Not okay. very fast. Now, unfortunately for us, speed in a group is actually a bad thing because you have to slow down to the speed of the slowest guy, which happens to be you. Okay, well, let's see if we can run away. Yes, Four. we can. Yes, we can. Of course. So Absolutely basically, fine. as a group, yeah. in a case of a wit or a brawn test, there's a good thing because everybody can contribute. In case of a speed test, then it's better to be a very fast single guy than actually a bunch of guys will have to wait for the slowest guy. Sorry, you. guys. But yeah, no, we made it. Okay. So in the case of a success, you discard the card. If we fail, we would have been run over by the cleaners, which is not nice. Yeah. Let's not go there. Mm -mm. Okay. Right, Ludo. All right, have the babe. Okay, so Ludo gets the babe. Ludo goes at the speed of the slowest player, which so, is the green die. Yeah, or slower. Or slower. Or slower. No, he's not going to go slower. Yeah. So let's just see. A one. A one. Slower. Left okay. or right? Oh, it doesn't matter. Either way, let's let's, let's go, go towards, towards Stephanie. Sarah. <laughs> Sarah. <laughs> I can't stop I doing this, it's embarrassing! Is he doing it intentionally? No, no, no I'm not. really not. I'm really okay, not. Right. All, whenever it comes to okay. Labyrinth, for months, all it's I've okay. heard Warren okay. do it's is okay. that, that right. smells the, bad. The, 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 lawyers, the lawyers from Hanson will come to your door, it's no problem. Yeah, it's, I apologize. As long as I don't say it, it's so fine. So let's see, what, right. what, what do we get to do? <laughs> Alright. So, um, this card is the, it just goes on and on and on. You know where Sarah just, Stephanie, have <laughs> meets this corridor that never ends. Yeah, and yeah. It seems like, well, there's no turns, there's no openings, nothing. <laughs> right, so it's a wit test against the yellow dice. Okay. So the Labyrinth says eight. Right. Oh. Give me my black dice. Okay. okay. So okay. you're a witty guy because you know a lot about the Labyrinth. And you nine. do indeed tell us, oh, it's, nine. it's full of openings. Look, there's one there. So mm -hmm. No problem. Because Hoggle has the highest wit because he knows, you know, he's kind of he the caretaker. Care 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 keep he keeps... Okay, mm -hmm. so this stays care on the board? Care, rather. Yeah. So if somebody lands there, the, the thing is there. Yeah. Obviously, okay. the more cards on the board like that, the less chances there are of going through the deck. Mm -hmm. So, so, uh, so it becomes although, more difficult. Although I was the one that moved that, because we were a group, we were, the group was able to take that yes. wet test, yeah. and because yeah. he had the highest wit, he was the obvious one. Yes. Yeah. We, we could have rolled as well, but because he beat it, there was no need of us rolling. Mm -hmm. If he didn't, then we could have tried to roll an egg. Yes. That's okay, what right. So, over to Sarah. Sarah yes. <laughs> right, I so... I will continuously do this through the show, I apologize. Sarah, let's see. Am I allowed to hit you every time? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I, I just, elbow just you every one, time. One of the ribs, okay. go ahead. Okay, okay. One. Right, so Sarah rolls a one. She's just going to move... Over to here mm -hmm. and burn a card. Let's see what we've got. A goblin knight. You know, mm -hmm. you see them sometimes moving around between the edges. So you can <clears throat> fight it. Yeah. Fight it on a purple die, mm -hmm. a brown, or speed, run away on a yellow die. I'm going to go with speed on a yellow die because okay. my brawn is very low. 
but my speed is a purple die, so... Okay. okay. Three, two, okay. one... Eight versus a four. Oh. It catches you up. So now you have a choice of either losing a willpower, mm -hmm. which will knock you out, or you could use... Oh, it's a speed test. So in a speed test, I'm afraid your special ability card... Because we have special abilities as well. We Now's do. a good time maybe to talk about special abilities, sure. so as we know when to use them yep. later on. So each character has a special ability, mm -hmm. which allows them to use a blue die against one kind of a test. Yes. Or in some cases, uh, maybe well, two times of a test. mine does wit and brawn. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mine does... Uh, wit. 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 So it's wit, brawn... Brown, yeah, and, and brown. brown. Okay. And they're all themed to the movie. I mean, the, in case of you, the Ludo special ability is called Rogue's Friends. Rogue's Friends. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, so in this case, I don't really want to spend that because no, I want to. I want to keep uh, that. You, you can't wait it's anyway. Test. This is oh, speed. So it's a speed no. test. So, so, so what happens then? I, I so you lose your last will. Mm -hmm. When you lose your last will, your character gets knocked out. Basically, gets depressed and sad, and mm -hmm. kind of gives up hope a bit. Which means that again, the ground opens up, swallows you. You land in the oubliette, and you kind of fall asleep and get knocked out in the oubliette, mm -hmm. where you then you can recover. And but you will waste time to get okay. back some some willpower, which is not a yeah. good thing. Okay. Because right. it's not a good thing because, because this, uh, the clock ticks we're forward. Now to the fourth round. Uh, uh, the fourth hour. Almost a third of the way through. Right. So okay. I'm just gonna. So pig nose, over to you now. Yeah, I'm just gonna roll my my green dice. See where we can go. Four. Four. So I will go uh, one, two, three, four to an open slot. Okay. We meet some fairies. Oh, lovely. Really puny. They only roll a d4. Would you like to be the pu the fairies? Okay, I'll be the yeah. fairies. Oh, sorry, I should have left the goblin knight where we met. Where mm -hmm. did you meet the goblin knight? Oh, uh, it was, it was Sarah. Sarah. There. There. So there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Two. two. So I'll yeah, roll my two. my brawn. A two. two. That's no problem. Mm -hmm. So we don't need to roll. Yeah, you defeated the fairies. You defeated the mighty fairies in single combat. Well done. <laughs> um, then Sir Didymus uh -huh. will slow down to hoggle speed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Set hoggle speed. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, no, not the fairies camp. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, most definitely this way. Okay. No, the fairies camp. Helping hands. Right, the helping hands. We can just choose up or down. In other words. Or even what we like, guys. I like evens. 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 Yes. It. Evens. We're good. In which case, nothing happens. We chose the. We chose right. Mm -hmm. Well, you. Well done, me. Mm. Okay. Um, Ludo gets the babe. Mm -hmm. There you go. Okay. So Ludo travels at the speed of the group. Mm -hmm. Okay. So six. a six. Let's go this way. Yeah, let's okay. go towards Sarah. Towards Sarah and away from Jar. Yeah. Sounds like a good yeah. so. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Okay. Gloomy, scary forest. Right. So we get lost in the gloomy, scary forest, which is again an exception card where everybody will have to test individually because mm -hmm. we can follow different rules and we get slightly lost. So uh, you may begin. I'll be the forest against your wit. So All right. So the wit of Ludo is low. It's a green. Mm -hmm. I rolled a one. A one. Oh, I can beat that. Yes. A six. Ludo is fine. Okay. And you can do me, so I will have a wit okay. against the scary forest. Um, a six. Come on, come on, Didymus. No, a Didymus two. gets lost. So Didymus gets lost. What happens if he gets lost? Fail. I lose one willpower. Okay, I'll lose one willpower. Yeah, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Yep. All mm -hmm. right, uh, then I'll have my black dice if someone wants to roll the purple yep, against me. Yeah, you want to be the, the forest. Okay. A two. Uh-oh. And eight. an eight. I get lost. Okay. Uh, so. Yeah, I'm just going to take it on the chin and lose the willpower. Okay. Okay, so the forest remains there and mm -hmm. he's drawn quite a lot of will out of us. Mm -hmm. It's quite a sad place, right. scary place. So that's, yeah. uh, that's the end of Ludo's turn. Yep. Yeah. Now Sarah. it passes over to Sarah. Now Sarah is. is asleep. So whenever it's your turn to move, you can either move by rolling or you can rest. If you rest, yeah. So you decide to rest so you don't roll. In any space, you just roll a green dice, and on a 4+, plus, you rest properly, and you get a one willpower. Mm -hmm. 
if you're in the oubliette, when you rest in the oubliette, you actually get it automatically. So Sarah in this turn has to rest because she's asleep. Yep. <laughs> she wakes up and she gains automatically one willpower. Awesome. In the future turns, you will be able to choose to stay there to gain more willpower or mm -hmm. to move out. And when to do it will be up to you, of course. Okay. Bad thing to stay there a lot of time because... Yeah, if you give me the babe, we're now on to the fifth round. Ooh. Time is ticking away. It is. Right. Okay. Right. So it's, we'll it's time to move. So, Hognose, your turn. Uh, we'll move one. <laughs> so I'll just move us one across to here. Okay. To open slot. Mm -hmm. Let's see what we Should get. Be absolutely fine. The door of the two knockers. Oh. <laughs> the two knockers. <laughs> <on> the doors. <laughs> At the weak test against the purple dice is fairly difficult. Okay. So okay. if I can get my black die. Oh yeah, the, okay, it will be, I'll be the knockers. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm the knockers, I roll a four, I'll be fine. Eleven. <laughs> no problem. So, the wit all... It stays. Okay. So we don't need to roll. Yeah, so mm -hmm. the board is starting to fill up. It is. Okay, over to Sir Didymus. Sir yep. Didymus, again, let's move as a group. Mm -hmm. One. One. There is a slot. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. we're not so bad. <clears throat> oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. This is funny because this is Jareth appears. The bowl. So he invites us to this bowl and there's no Sarah. So he's basically <laughs> dancing with Ludo. <laughs> 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 and Didymus and his dog and Hoggle. Dance bad. <laughs> Dance <Jared>. very bad. <laughs> <laughs> right, so Jareth appears. Um, <laughs> we have to test the wit, wit test. Yep, take a wit test against the against the mighty Jareth dice. I'll okay. beat a Jareth dice. A one. A one. How many times have you rolled a one on a Jareth? I should, I should, I should keep doing it. That's a good, I think Ludo will take that test. <laughs> no, no, it's fine. We, 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 beat, we beat already. So, mm -hmm. Okay, success with his card. Oof. Okay. This card is bad because if he, if he rolls high, of course, and it's difficult to beat him, if you don't beat him, you stay there in the ball and until you can beat him. So right. he will stay okay. there. Oh, so you know, I'm trapped, right. Yeah, yeah. 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 It keeps yeah. going on until you can make your way out you know, in your head. Okay, Ludo. Yeah. Right, so the lo slowest speed again, we're still on the green die. Yeah. Do you maybe want to go at a higher speed and leave me behind? Just because we're a little bit surrounded here. No, I don't think we should ever split up. It's never a good idea. No, I don't think we should split up. Right, let's okay. see. Now, in fact, we should try to join up with Sarah, a even six. even though he has a peach. I think we should still try to. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. No point in going that direction. Not, not in the fire's camp now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. I think we go to there. Yeah, leave Jareth. Behind. Leave Jareth, Jareth behind. Okay. But they didn't like my bow. Okay. <laughs> right. Yeah. Ambushed by fires, so we didn't go into the fires camp. Instead, we get ambushed by fires. <laughs> okay, and this is not as bad as the camp, of course. Uh, so it's just a brown test against the purple die. Mm -hmm. And I say just. Uh, so you brown test. Yeah, I'll, I'll roll this. Mm -hmm. A six. Six. Can you do it? Eleven. 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 We don't need to roll. No we have problem. a big, big thingy there. That yeah. <laughs> this card. Okay. 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 Uh, so that's Sarah? Ludo over to Sarah. Do you and want to maybe heal up a little bit? Yeah, Sarah's just going to stay where she's at for the moment and to continue rest. to build up that pool okay. of willpower. So, so. I get this, and we will move to turn six. Oh, half turn six. Going on. Oh, right. Okay. Right. Let's try and speed things up here. So I get a three. Yep. So one, two, three. Mm -hmm. Ludo there. You met a goblin mob. Lovely. You can we can we can try to run away from it. Um, oh no, sorry. We can try to trick it with a wit test mm -hmm. or fight it with brawn. Uh, they are definitely easier to outwit than to fight. So I think we I'll, should I'll try to outwit them with yeah. uh, okay. my black die. Okay. So okay. Uh, is it just against the green die? So we need to beat a three. Yeah. No problem. No problem. Laughing. I, you know, Sedidimus is in a great place because he has the strongest friend yeah. and, the, and the cleverest friend. So mm -hmm. I'm kind of looking at my friends going, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yeah, you resolve them, no problem. <laughs> I'm just uh, prancing around. So the Goblin Mold is defeated and discarded. Discarded. Okay. Right. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Right. I like, I like fighting monsters because it's leaving open slots for us to run around and actually yes. try and find the gate. Okay, Sir Didymus. Sir Didymus mm -hmm. sticks with his friends, with his great friends that are strong and clever. Five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Not the helping hand. One, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. Much just some more goblins. 
this time there is no chance of outwitting them. They want to fight. Unfortunately, they're not very good. Unfortunately for them, I mean. Mm -hmm. All they get is a four. The okay. best they get is a four. So we need to beat a four. Well, I'll go in with that with my brawn. Mm -hmm. Test okay. we see on a black dice. Eleven. Uh, 11. <laughs> no get, problem. Get strong friends. <laughs> right. Smash the goblins. Right. Okay, so Ludo. I Ludo in this instance is going to go with a white dice, or sorry, the red okay. dice, okay. to hopefully get a one, and then we can land with Stephanie. Okay. Or, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, three. Oh no. <clears throat> oh, so we no. have helping hands. The two knockers again. Our two knockers are the Goblin Knight. Yeah, Goblin Knight. Come on. Goblin, yeah, Knight, or Goblin or Knight. Smash yep. up. Okay. Break the Goblin Knight. There you go. So, right, so what uh, do we have to do? If I pull the card out here. So test, uh, choose brawn versus one purple die, or speed versus one yellow die. I think we should fight him. Not brawn. No way. Brawn. brawn. Yeah. Let's okay. go brawn, okay? okay? So brawn versus one purple die. Right, so I'll roll this. Uh-huh. Uh, oh, a nine. Oh, a nine. A nine. Versus yours. Brilliant. Brawn. Okay. Uh, Didymus is... One, <laughs> one. So okay. So. Didymus has a chance. Uh -huh. Is Braun D10 as well? So nine or more. Yeah. Come on, Ambrosius! Oh! And uh, uh, you cannot beat it. I cannot beat it. Yeah. <clears throat> I think However, I'll, uh, Ludo could spend. Yeah, you could, uh, or I could, but yes. Uh, I so have Ludo. more, so Ludo is going to spend one of his willpower uh -huh. to, roll D20. to roll the D20. All right. And to get to more nine. than nine. 15! Not <laughs> better. So basically, uh, Ludo was asleep, uh, rolling a one. Discard this card. Yeah. Okay. Well, Ludo luckily wakes up and goes, oh, wait. Beat him up. Right. right. The yep. card passes to Sarah. Uh -huh. um, yeah, join Do him. you want to heal? No. No. Join no. no, she's going to try and join now. So okay. um, she's going to roll a red die. A three. three. Oh. Oh. Five. One, two. Oh, she can't. Right. Okay. So. She can't actually go this way because we're seeing it in action. Now, one, two, three, Jarrett's in there, so she can't land there. Right. So she has to go one, two, three into the fire. Fiery's camp. camp. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> A classic example where you would never want to go there, but yeah. Jarrett forces you yes. to go that way. So uh, you can choose your speed versus one purple die, uh -huh. or you can test brawn versus one purple and one black die. We'll go speed. speed. <laughs> yeah. We'll go speed, right. So who's going to roll for... I'll let you do it, Alessio, because I, I roll horribly <laughs> high on these. Well, the worst is going to happen. Oh, it's a seven. seven. It was almost a one. Okay. Three. Yeah. So a seven versus a three. three. Of course. Mm. Right. Uh, so, spend do you have an ability? She could not? spend one to no, use a blue dice. Speed, right, or yeah. you can just take it on the chip. So we can. She'll spend one to roll the blue. To, she's going to gamble. Okay. okay. I think she's gamble against a seven. But actually, in this There's case, no it makes point. no sense to gamble because the best result you can get is just to leave it on the space. So leave it on the space. So there is no point in gambling anyway. because you're on your own. If you were as a group. Yeah. Then it would make sense gambling because then you're saving everybody from losing the, the world. Yeah. Okay. But as right. you're in, on your own, there is no point in gambling. Okay. okay. Right. That's well, give me the and the and we're on turn seven. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, I think I'm just going to roll us a red die. <laughs> you want to go into Goblin's camp too? Oh, yeah, actually, camp no. To, to meet no, Sarah. but I don't want to go too far away from Sarah. Good point. Good point. Yeah. So. Yeah. Four. I was just going to say, don't roll a four. Whatever <laughs> <laughs> you do. One, two. Three, four, uh, four. which is oh, okay. 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 <laughs> so, we're going to here. And finally we get to burn for another card. <laughs> what did we get? Right, so this is the card for you. I'll leave okay. it to you to read. Uh, so, Jareth appears. Jareth appears. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Magic dance. Place Jareth on this faith. Uh, give this card to another player who will read Jareth's part. You must answer correctly by heart. Okay. Ah! Oh! <laughs> I have to remember stuff. You remind me of the babe. What babe? The babe with the power. What power? The power of voodoo. Who do? You do. Who do? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you did quite well there. You always got it. What was the last line? Uh, let, let, me, let me do it. Let me do it. <clears throat> you remind me of the babe. What babe? The babe with the power. What power? The power of voodoo. Voodoo? You do. Do what? Remind me of the bee. Oh, <laughs> one line. <laughs> well, okay, so it's a fail. What happens in a fail? It, it is a fail. Discard this card and lose one willpower. 
All of us or just me? Uh, all of us. Oh, <laughs> right. Uh, so. Last. <laughs> I almost had it. Okay. Right. Uh, so it's Sir Didymus next. Yep. So I get to babe. <laughs> Remind me of the babe. And yeah. we go two. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll go towards Sarah. One, two. Okay. <laughs> Oh no, not the trash lady. Oh. We met the trash lady. She's a she's the most powerful wit based monster except for Jareth, really. Okay. So oh it's like Oh darling, do you want your toys? Uh you roll a D twelve, a black dice for the, right. for the lady, well, please. See what you get. Hmm? Be the trash lady. A two. A two. A two. Thanks God. Right. I'll roll my God. black. Mm. Anything but a one. Yeah. Nine Perfect. Nine. Uh, okay. We trash the trash lady. Excellent. Oh, I have to redeem myself after that. <laughs> okay, so it comes over to Ludo. Ludo. Yeah. Um, a little bit oh. higher. A yeah, we'll, we'll go with the we'll go with the green die. A six. So what have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six. Nope. One, nope. two, three, four, five, six. Let's okay. go that way. Yes, let's go this way. The wise man. And his hat. Mm -hmm. So this is a good card. You keep it on your uh, on your sheet. It gives you some advice. Mm -hmm. So that basically means that you have a free uh, blue dice for, for, for a, a wit, wit test. test. Yeah. Okay. okay. Which it, Ludo in particular needs. Needs, so. needs, needs some advice. Uh -huh. Like yeah, remember, the way forward sometimes is the way back. Okay. Sarah. Over to Sarah again. Yep. So Sarah's going to move her full speed. Uh huh. Trying to catch up. A nine. So, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's yeah. okay. Or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is closer to us. I think she will go yeah. to there to Try be closer. To join up. Okay. She finds some snares. Mm -hmm. She has to take a test, a wit test against the green dice. Okay. Not to fall into the snares, not to be trapped. Okay, so Sarah rolls on a purple mm -hmm. dice. Yeah, it should be easy, right? A four three. versus a three. No problem. That's She's fine. grand. So this area is full of traps where, okay. like, uh, where where, uh, okay. where Ludo fell in. Mm -hmm. Pass me the bib. However, okay. turn eight. 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 Time okay. is ticking. Time is right. ticking. Uh, I'm just gonna roll. Okay, Hogwarts. A red dice to see if we can land on Sarah. Yeah. Okay. Even sure. if we have to deal with the snare again, it doesn't seem too bad. A four last. <laughs> so one, <laughs> two, three, four. Okay. So we'll go to here. Yep, because you couldn't go the other way because, again, Jareth is in the yep. way. Which is a real pain. Right. So, draw a card, Alessio. Ah, <laughs> uh, he's, he's following us. Right. right. Um, Prince of the Land of Stench. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're just next to the, to the Book of Eternal Stench, so clearly, <laughs> yeah. clearly he goes, Prince of the Land of Stench. Uh, test the wit against the blue dice, okay? Mm. I'll be Jareth. A nine. A nine. Uh, we mm. can do this. No, I can't. I can. You can. I you can. can with a black die, yeah. Come on. Our only hope. A four. A four. No, a it's two. not. It's not our only hope, because remember that Ludo ah. had met with the wise man and his hat, uh -huh. so he gets a blue die if he, he spends does. this card. So yeah. come on, Ludo. So maybe he gives him some, some advice about the stench. Oh, smell bad. Come on, Sarah. Ludo. Come on, Ludo. Yes, Oy, no, no. 16, yeah. <laughs> Thanks to the wise man and his hat. Mm. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Phew. All right, so two Sir Didymus. Yes, otherwise we would have flung us in the, in the book of the stage. <laughs> and all no, three, we, all three, three of us would have got that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of us. We would have to test not to fall into it. So it like, oh. <laughs> uh, because it's bad to smell bad forever. Right. Right. Sir so Didymus. I think we'll slow down again, trying to get to Sarah, I think is a good idea. A two. There you go. So okay. we can actually get a card. Or meet Sarah. I think let's meet Sarah. So we're yes. all together. Yes, yep. let's get together. So okay. we all go so, there. We'll have to just fight against the, or rather survive against the snares. Snares are not too bad. It's just a, yeah. mm -hmm. just a green dice. But we also have the peach test. There is a peach test before yes. the snares. Yes. Is it before the, the snares? Test? Yes, right. so immediately, isn't The it? peach test says, when in the same space as Sarah, immediately test wit versus one blue die. Yep. Can, oh, no. <laughs> Does that all of us as a group test that, no, no, or no. just me? It's uh, it's a blue test. So uh, where is the you test? Yeah, sorry. Let me read the card. Oh no! I so... just spent my opportunity <laughs> to, to beat that. <laughs> you cannot you cannot test as a group. Oh no! Oh <laughs> yeah. no! The, the wise man could have told you. The Don't man... give her the peach. <laughs> <laughs> Don't give her the peach. <laughs> <laughs> I I just spent the only chance we had. Oh, okay, right. What are the so... chances? You cannot right. wait, Jared. Let's see. 
A five and a nineteen. Beach. Beach Sarah. Right, so, so what happens fail. to Sarah? This guy's got Sarah loses one willpower and falls asleep. And oh. Sarah's last willpower. Oh God. So, so Sarah as well as that, she goes flying into the bliette. Into the bliette. Just like oh. in the movie. Mm -hmm. like said, goes and a boof. <laughs> neither, she go? neither snares. You. Uh -huh. On the other end, loses you lose two willpower out of guilt. Oh no, my last two willpower. <laughs> so you also so fall into the head. <laughs> <laughs> so we finally got all together, and then you went. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Hoggle. <laughs> like, ah, <laughs> ah, oh. right. Okay. So, suddenly, Hoggle and Hoggle just go. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? <laughs> <laughs> they were here a moment ago. Right. You know you guys have to do the snare test. Yeah. So snare test for you and me, Alessia. Yes, yes, mm -hmm. yes. So you want to be the snares? Okay. <clears throat> so a five. five. Okay. Versus? Versus wit. So wit. my wit is a yellow. Two. Two. Oops. I've got a black wit. Yeah, oh, six. No problem. Five. Just a bite. Okay. Phew. Okay, things are not going too well. Okay. <laughs> Ludo's turn. So Ludo up, gain a willpower. Yeah, That's Ludo right. stands up. Same for gains Sarah. A willpower. So and then well. Sarah stands yeah. up, gains a willpower. Yeah, I get the babe. The babe goes and over we're the clock. To round nine. Uh oh. oh. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's go and get them. Mm -hmm. Five. So one, two, three, four, five. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Go to here. Okay. Yep. What's our card? You know, I'm hating myself because I really would like to think and know how many cards we go through and what are our chances now. And because it keeps going in there, I just go, I don't know how many cards I, I we have no to go idea through. I hate it. Who designed this yeah. nonsense? <laughs> <laughs> You're an evil man, Lester. Right. <clears throat> so we, uh, we're in the junkyard uh -huh. uh, where the junk ladies live. So it's not a good place, not a nice place to be in. Uh, we have to test wit against a purple die. Ah. So, okay. <clears throat> what's our target? All right. So a purple die. An eight. An eight. Oh, I can do that. I can do okay, that. Give I can try. do that. No, nope. can't six. do that. I can do that. Come on, come on. You know the way out of this? A no. six. Oh, no. no. But so, I can use my special ability. You could. To actually retest that on, on a, a, on a, a blue. D20. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, I'm trying to beat an eight, yeah? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Ten. <laughs> okay. Five. Oh, that was very close. So, oh, okay. I'll pass this in. So, you've so nice spent that. Yeah, and this yeah. goes, stays on the table. So, mm -hmm. that's the junkyard. Okay. Right, uh, Sir Didymus. Sir Didymus. Sir Didymus. Um, we'll go at your speed. Four. four. One, two, three, four. Ooh. Fairy camp. Fairy camp. One, two, three, four. We'll go away from them, of course. We don't like them. I think mm -hmm. it's important to burn for these cards. I think we've been yeah. a bit relaxed on that. The cleaners. Ah. ah. <laughs> it's a speed test, and luckily I'm quite fast. However, I'm, I'm in not. a group with a very slow guy, so I have to wait for you. <laughs> Come on, run, run. <laughs> <laughs> Against the yellow die. <laughs> okay. I'll let you roll this. No, right, you're, so, you're the slow guy. Right, you're the slow see. poke. So eight. Oh, oh dear. You can't so, beat it. You no, can't no. beat it. I can't beat, beat it. Will for it. And it's a it's a speed test, so there's nothing we can do about it. Uh, so, uh, you yeah, no, we we joined up with them because we all end up in the end. <laughs> uh, I lose my last roll. I lose my last two <laughs> willpowers because the cleaners are really nasty. Two willpowers. So we are together again. <laughs> We're all together again in the end. That might actually be a tactic to get everybody together. Very clever, yes. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. Now is Ludo's turn. Um, well, if we're going to stay together, we have to wait for a while, yeah. don't we? So yes. Ludo may as well wait and uh, rest yeah. and yep. get another willpower. Yep. And then Sarah's Sarah going to wait and rest and get another willpower. Yeah. I'll and get the clock. We got ten. Goes to ten. Oh. I wake up and gain a willpower. Uh, correct. So does Sir Didymus. So do I. And I think I'm happy enough to run around on the one. Yes, road. we have to. We have to. There is no okay. choice. Let's so go. When it comes so, to Ludo, you guys can move. Both yes. of you wait. And now, guys, we have three hours to go <laughs> and a half. Yeah. We have very little willpower, but we still have some cards. Mm -hmm. Let's try to do it. This All is right. not good looking very good. <laughs> can I make a suggestion here, Warren. Yes. Roll the red die right now. Because we're really, really crowded in around here, so I think that's going to give us the best chances of actually landing on something we're going to get to draw. One, two, three, four. Yes, whatever result you get to burn okay. for a card. Very so, clever. Yeah. That is very clever, isn't yeah. it? So let's see, what do we get? Three. three. Yeah. So one, two, three. No, one, two, three. So let's go one, two, three. 
three to here. That's yep. right. Any result between Who one and four. Who coming with me? Everybody. All of us. <laughs> Everybody goes. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. It's now or never. Basically, this is okay. This is all go, make or break. Death or glory. <laughs> yep, okay. yep. Either we solve this lever in now or Goblin Knight. So this poor Goblin Knight on a yellow dice will have to fight all of us. Mm -hmm. It's just a single yellow dice and he rolls a two. And he so rolls a two. Can we roll anything but a one? Well, let's basically. get a brawn here, okay? So uh, <laughs> smash. Six of Noodle <laughs> smashed him. No problem. Yep. Uh, okay. Right. So now to Sarah. Come on, Sarah. Mm -hmm. So Sarah's going to move us on the slowest speed. Oh, this okay. Six. Yeah, this six is good. That's a yeah. good spread there. Six. six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So Perfect. we'll go to there. Yes, we like that. Okay. Come on, be the be the gate, be the gate, be the gate. It's not the gate. Oh, <laughs> it's the doors of the four guards. <clears throat> one of us always tells the truth. The oh, other one no. always lies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, and one door leads to certain death, the other one leads to the castle. Uh, okay, it's a wit test against a black die, so it's really, really difficult. Who has the best wit? Hoggle. I do, with Hoggle. a wit of black, but... Right, well, let's roll to roll. see what you're up against. Okay, first. let's see what okay. we get to face. A 12. <laughs> That was a D12, wasn't it? Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> so, uh, oh, try Hoggle. again. Come on, Hoggle. <laughs> You're our only hope, Hoggle. No. no, no, obviously not. Do right. we have any spare will? Do we have any, Wait. any special ability? Yes. yes Sarah has yes. A, a blue, uh, she has a special Come ability on, card that she can roll against wit. Okay. Does anybody at that speed, and this is brawn, or they're both brawn? Yeah, uh, we're on brawn. I so. had wit, but I had to use it. Yeah. So, but, Sarah, but either that or willpower, so. I think Top she'll spend a willpower. Really? Yes. Okay. If All you right. fail, you're back to the oblivion, of course. Yeah, I know. Okay. But it's oh, it's, it's to beat a twelve, isn't it? Yeah, On a D twelve. 12, 12, 12, 12, 12 is All of us except for Ludo are back to the oblivion. <laughs> oh, what do we <laughs> yes, do? That is correct. What do we do? We right, have to we pass can't, it. Right, we have to pass it. She's going to have to spend her ability. Yes. Yes, okay. Yes, yes, so yes. right, so she spent the ability. Come I on. need more than a 12. 12, okay. or more. 12 or more. 12 or more. A 9. No! Okay, okay, okay. Willpower now. Willpower no, no, now. no, we do willpower. Okay, willpower. so no, she's going to spend a willpower. <laughs> ah! no! Ludo, 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 willpower, Ludo. Ludo's going to spend a willpower. <laughs> do it. A no! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So uh, uh, that was Sarah moving us, yeah. Yeah. Okay, yes. give me the babe. Oh, okay. Long 11. to eleven. Uh -huh. Right. So now we're all out of willpower. So yep. we yep. spend an entire turn where everybody just stands up and gets the yep. willpower mm -hmm. back. And so basically, this goes around. Yeah. Yep. We all get so a willpower. Everybody gets a willpower. Yeah, we have uh, one, one, one. We all have one. No, no, one. Okay. One willpower. Oh yes, we lost, we lost yeah. all our willpower. And what yeah. happens then? Unfortunately. Bong. Yeah. Right. Well, mm -hmm. so basically, I think we're doomed. I don't uh, think we can do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna roll the red die. Yeah. Because safe landing. A three. So three. One, so that's two, out three. Here again. So it yeah. brings us over to one, two, <laughs> Guess three. Guess what I rolled? Is it one, the gate? Is the gate? Oh, awesome! Uh, we, <laughs> awesome. Right. we might just make it. <laughs> right. So it is the gate. <laughs> so, right. Okay. What happens now is Jareff panics because we reached the gate. Like, uh -huh. What? The hell did they make it to the gate? So he retreats to his castle and calls up the guard. Mm -hmm. right. So first of all. Humongous goes to guard the, the gate. Boom! <laughs> mm -hmm. Huge. And then he summons the goblin infantry. Uh huh. And then mm -hmm. the goblin cavalry. If you've seen the movie, you know what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. <laughs> and finally, the governor artillery, the guy with the machine gun on right. his head and, and the nose, cannon nose. Sir Didymus? Sir Didymus goes, right, I Charge. roll. <laughs> I roll, uh, we got go the any speed, it doesn't matter. So three, yep. this space it, it is adjacent to this space, so we first meet Humongous. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Humongous is a D20. Okay. Okay. Brawn. It's yep. really strong. He rolls a nine. Okay. We can do it. We can do it. Come on. You got I can do it. Didymus is a D10. <laughs> a one. A one. No. But Ludo. Ludo is a D12. Come Ludo on, Ludo. Ludo is a D12. Come on Ludo. Come on, Ludo. Come on, Ludo. Come on, Ludo. A two. <laughs> Anybody else can roll a nine? No. No. You're not strong enough. It's time for me to use my special it's time ability card. When yes. I go. Charge! <laughs> 
<laughs> Put on your weapons and I see that you're well treated. <laughs> okay. Okay. D20. So we need more than a nine. A Twelve! Twelve! <laughs> so Didymus charges in against you and goes, <laughs> So you might right. die. Oh, no. Nobody dies. Nobody dies. Uh, nobody dies. Knocked, knocked out. Knocked out. Knocked out. Nobody dies. Ludo gets to go. Okay. So Ludo. Uh, <laughs> rolls the speed. It doesn't really matter because we're just moving one at a time here. Yes, so yes. the group. Moves to the next one. Yeah. yeah, basically you still roll, and wait, but you have to stop when By you make one as a of these. Group at yeah. this point is certainly helping. It isn't certainly it? So, helps. Yeah. Okay, so what do we need to do? To right. Defeat so now these there's guys? a bunch of goblin infantry. They mm -hmm. use the weakest three dice, so they go red, green, yellow. Okay. Mm -hmm. So they roll all three and oh. pick the best. Basically, they're testing as a group as well. Yeah. So there's a group of them. Six. No, eight. Ooh, eight. eight. So the best I roll the get... highest on each dice. Yeah. Four, six, eight. On which side are you, <laughs> really? <laughs> So an eight. We have to beat an eight. Hoggle, right, Ludo right? needs to beat an eight. Ah, seven. seven. No wait. Come on. I have brawn. Come on, Dinimus. Come on, Dinimus. You can do it. Done. One. Can can you do it? Uh, seven. For you a brawn. Can. Yeah, you can. You can. You can. Okay. Six. Uh, no. Six. Ludo. Ludo. Call the rocks. Call. Rocks friends. <laughs> do the howl. Do the howl. <laughs> <laughs> right, so a D20, okay. a D20, uh. come on. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Rock's not friends. <laughs> Rock's not <laughs> friends. <laughs> okay. Rock's not friends. So. What have we got? I uh, don't think we have anything. Oh, is this it? This is it. Is this it? This is it because, because. At this point, they will defeat us, and because we are all a <laughs> single willpower, we all lose one willpower. We'll go back to Libliet, which uh, means then the final turn. I don't the think. Yeah, that's right. So let's assume, for 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 the sake of argument, that by the power of playtesting, look, yes, defeated. We got a twenty. <laughs> okay. okay, just to right. continue the demo mm -hmm. of the game. So assuming you rolled more than was it eight? Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. So then there will be your turn. There, then be Sarah's, Sarah's turn. turn. That's right. right. Okay. She automatically gets to move at least one. Yeah. So Sarah next. would move one into the next one. Yep. Right. Which are the He's guys on cavalry? Okay. So the okay. cavalry uses the next. Mm -hmm. So this was infantry. So yeah. discard that. Add that. So that would be the goblin cavalry. Now oh, you can so they try to roll. They get stronger. Mm -hmm. Let's yep. try and not roll so horrendously yes. high. Let's. Uh, a six. six. A six. We can six do a six. Okay. We can do a six. So is this brawn again? It is brawn, yeah. Okay. Basically, so. is brawn, 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 wit against a d12. Mm -hmm. okay. in Jareth, okay. the, the maze at the end. Okay. Into the castle. So we have to beat six, you said? Yeah, six. Mm -hmm. I rolled the wrong dice. Seven. A seven. <laughs> Except well, that no, I rolled the wrong dice. Ludo. Ludo could have done that, though. Yeah. So, yeah. so you roll it. <laughs> that's okay. No, 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 no. Come Three. On. No. Okay. See if we get it. No. <sighs> but I have a d8. Okay. Yes. Six. Yeah. Okay. Right. Right. So, so Hoggle gets, gets to be the hero for once. Hoggle gets, gets to be to defeated. Them out. Now it passes around. Right. Yep. So this is the 13th last turn. turn. Okay. So thirteenth so turn. I'll move in to the next set. Yes. Mm -hmm. Regardless Bronze of what you roll. Okay. Oh, by the way, if we all, if one of us was knocked out because some of us had more willpower than nothing, mm -hmm. so some of us will continue to do this while the other person would rest a bit and then run. And get back and into try the room. to get back in. Yeah. So by you just the, need to roll the entrance. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So yeah. you can catch up later. Mm -hmm. but. Okay. So uh, the next, the artillery is the artillery, which is so. See if I remember. Well, we have the reference cards here, which mm -hmm. tell you so infantry, so humongous infantry, mm -hmm. cavalry, artillery. It's a yellow, purple, and black. Okay. Yellow, purple, and black. Show us. So it's getting progressively more difficult. Yes. Yeah, let's see what we got. Uh, eight. 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 We need to beat mm -hmm. an eight. That's doable. It's doable. Okay. It's doable as a so group. I'll, yep. I'll roll hoggles because I uh -huh. can get an eight. No. Did he miss? No. Nope. <laughs> Brawn for Ludo. Yes! Ten. A ten! <laughs> okay. Right. So now we beat all of Jarrett's guard with a little help on that one mm -hmm. roll. Yeah. Now, that was your turn, was it? It was my turn. Yep. So now it's my turn. I do nothing because actually I could heal. Rest. I could mm -hmm. rest. Um, in fact, when you rest together with the with the, the with rest friends, of the group, you yeah. could. Let me just resting with friends. You, know, you have the text of rest, and there are other characters in your space. You can share stories with them and talk through your worries and fears so that your friends can help you because that's what friends do. Uh, so you roll for rest. Any of the characters in the space can give one of their own willpower. So I will try to rest mm -hmm. and 
plus a d4, I need a 4 more. I didn't. If I had, you could have given. I could have Sarah. taken. I could have given you this. Kind of ah. give you like some, some, you know, so some help. So it passes to Ludo next. Yes. Right? He's going to rest. Yes. No. And also um, fails to he help also Sarah. He also fails to help Sarah. And now, so now it passes to Sarah. on the very thirteenth turn, uh -huh. Sarah can step into the maze and face Jareth. Basically, if she had a lot of cards and willpower, she mm -hmm. could try to. So now. <laughs> Because you don't have anything, burn all your cards. It's a straight, will. Wit it's a test. straight wit test against the D20. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what am I going to beat? 14. 14. I can't, can't beat that. Uh, you can't, without any willpower, without any special abilities or any cards, you can't do that. I can't right, beat that. Okay. Let's reroll that. No, 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 no. Well, I, I want to see how the game ends, though. I want to oh, see yes. how okay, right, if right. you win. So. Yeah, 14. 14. <laughs> <laughs> That's not why. What? We can assume that. Okay. For, yeah. For, to show people what okay. would happen if if I roll the one uh, and uh, you roll the uh, one. I roll the one. <laughs> so, <laughs> if we match, so yep. if you manage to defeat Jareth, yep. normally this is done through willpower, spending willpower mm -hmm. and using cards. You save your card for for this. You know, you build up to try to fight. But obviously, we were <laughs> at the very very end of our energies. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but uh, if you defeat him, then mm -hmm. what happens is you have to win. Mm -hmm. You have to recite this by heart. But of course, because we help you a bit, we can give you that and let you read it. <laughs> okay. Give me the child. Through dangers untold and hardships unnumbered, I have fought my way here to the castle beyond the goblin city to take back the child you have stolen. My will is as strong as yours, and my kingdom is great. You have no power over me. <laughs> and thus completes <laughs> Labyrinth. So, that's so my, really fun. Minus the last two rolls, which were <laughs> critical. <laughs> we would have made it on turn 13. Obviously, in this case, we wouldn't have made it. So we would have actually, if we're playing yeah. you know, strictly by yeah. the rules, we would have failed. <laughs> it's it's nice to, go. to see the game is not a pushover. Oh, it's... Uh, th there you have it, guys. That, I love that, that is labyrinth. Alessio, uh, when is it out? Well, we are aiming for June, but of course, you know, with all things do with approval and stuff, it may be slightly late. Mm. But yeah, June. We are aiming for June. Awesome. And if people want to learn more about labyrinth, head to the River Horse Facebook Facebook page. There's a labyrinth board game Facebook mm -hmm. page. There's our own River Horse uh, web page. So mm. there. Fantastic, Alessio. Thank you for bringing it in. <laughs> what a you. fabulous yeah. game. <laughs> okay, you. guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs> thank you.